good morning everybody welcome back to a brand new vlog um it is 11 34 i have been awake for a little while don't worry um i've just been in bed um doing stock replan for the salon um and just ordering so much stuff i'm so thankful that so many of like the companies that you need for like fillers like needles all that kind of stuff i'm so thankful that the majority of it is um next day um delivery so i just got those ordered um and yeah i've just been chilling in bed basically i need to get ready for the day because i'm actually gonna film it's such a nice day outside like it's so nice that the sun's out and i just feel really happy um we all know that i suffer majorly with sad um so when it's sunny my mood instantly is like Ping! um what was i saying yeah, so I want to film today. I went to Home Bargains yesterday. No, I didn't. That's a lie. I went to B&M yesterday. I spent £84. B&M. In all fairness, one of it was a present for Tom for his birthday. And the other thing was um, like a hair tool. So that was quite expensive. Like if you took those off, it's like a moderate normal shop. Um, but I'm going to get that film today and then I'm probably going to film the car clean with me which that makes me really remind me I need to charge my hoover um, so those are those are the little things I'm going to do today like last week like I said I made the list I've referred back and I've made a list again this is all stuff I need to order that's my list of things I need to replen um, yeah so I need to, I'm going to clean the car today let me add film B and M Hall. I need to edit as well. Crap, I need to edit really bad. Um, and yeah, so the UK opens back up tomorrow. I'm not working tomorrow. I'm not. I didn't open on that day, um, just because I just had so much to do, and I just didn't. I didn't really need to. Really, I just didn't want to open that day, so I didn't. I'm opening on Thursday, just for Thursday, because um, Friday is. I've got my husband appointment. Which, we're all very excited for aren't we and then saturday's Tom's birthday so it didn't make sense like going to work then not work and then work and then not work and so i just did one day just to get my asap clients in and then next week we're gonna go back i've got my clinic on monday in bolton and then i'm just gonna be working through the week here and there um i feel like my skin just needs looking after doesn't it so yeah i need to get ready because i need to do a content shoot i need to do a content picture today as well um i can't believe we're in december happy december everybody happy december um i love december um because it's tom's birthday and everyone's in the christmas spirit like i feel like in november like i mean in september i'm in the christmas spirit but in november everyone's like it's so early and i'm just like ugh. whereas like in december like everyone's feeling it and if you're not then that's on you babe like we did all we could we so we try to save you um yeah I'd, i really like november december like and then usually obviously you get to see family and it's full of like love and you know happiness and everything so i don't know i just Ooh. i just always like remember my childhood and christmas was such an amazing time when i was a kid so yeah i love christmas and, like i love december um and i think i don't really know why i've told you that i like that but there you go i don't really know what else i've been up to i haven't really been up to anything just been chilling max and relaxing oh my god so i watched harry potter the other day harry potter and the philosopher's stone sorcerer's stone if you're american but it's philosopher's stone i'm not gonna lie and there were so many like different scenes that i've never ever seen before i have watched harry potter con constantly since i was a child right this was like a i was like what is happening it was like un it was like the unseen version or like the extras version i don't really know what it was called there was a, a scene in there like near enough at the beginning um it was when it's the same time that ha if you haven't watched harry potter this is going to be a spoiler alert but more on you what are you doing go and what turn me off <laughs> i don't mind my watch minutes being low if it means you're going to watch harry potter um 
so yeah so it was basically the point where it was just before the letters came it was the same day that the letters came but it was like before the original scene that we see and Dudley is at like the mantelpiece like posing in like his private school uniform and like Vernon's taking the picture and then Aunt Petunia is like boiling Harry Potter's suit like not a suit but like uniform like over the stove like it's so weird and Harry was like I'm not going to have to wear that am I Oh wait, no, Harry Potter's not posh. Is he? I'm not going to have to wear that, am I? And then Aunt Petunia's like, don't be silly, you're going to state school. Um, that's my posh accent, by the way, if you ever hear me say that. I, I'm impersonating someone who is posh. Um, so that happened, and I was like, what the hell? And then in the potions class with Snape, when Snape's like when Harry Potter is just like constantly writing things down and he's just like pay attention or whatever Snape comes over and starts talking to him about something else like it's so weird I was literally like what is happening this is not the Harry Potter I know I'm here for it but now I have to relearn these lines like do you know what I mean um but anyway that was uh that was all that's really happened to me is Harry Potter was new um but yeah anyway kids i'm gonna get ready finish my wee pen for the salon which has a load off my mind i'm gonna finish when we get ready and then um i don't know what i'm doing i have no idea what i'm doing oh get ready film 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 and then clean my car put your hoover in charge though will do let's go okay I've never really spoke about this or told you guys before. Um, I moved out when I was 16 and loads of stuff happened and it was, that would be a, a different video at a different time when I come to my demons with that. Anyway, um, and um, I moved in with people who were family friends and for one reason or another things went south um, and I left and blah blah. Now all of my childhood stuff um, and things that um, I had as a kid and um, some things of my parents were at that place um and i've never really been able to get them back just like i said for one thing reason or another things just went south and um i've been in contact with someone who knows them and what have you and and she's messaged to say that they have found a cassette tape of my mom talking and I know exactly what it is because I remember listening to it when I was there which was about 10 years ago oh god I'm so sorry guys I'm so so sorry I didn't want to cry <laughs> anyway they're gonna send it to me Um, yeah. Um, yes, yeah, so they're gonna send that to me, and I um, no, I'm crying, <laughs> but I do feel really happy. Um, I just need to find a cassette player. <laughs> There's like some for sale that are like 18 quid, so I'm just gonna buy it. Ask some people if they've got one, um, just in case I can just like borrow one. Um, if not I'm just going to buy one like you cannot put a price on um, you cannot put a price on like hearing your mum's voice for the first time um, oh I just have to let you guys know I'm just really happy right now and I just can't, can't wait hello um, it's actually the next the next night i was gonna say the next day it's the next night um yesterday i was um cleaning my car it took forever 
Um, you guys will see that video. I want to say next week. It could be the week after. If I mean, I mean, it's like the week you're watching this actually. But I think, um, yeah, you'll see it um, then, um, and you'll understand why it took forever. Um, and then today, I've just been editing. I need to send the pictures I took on my phone to my laptop to put the video live because the video, the pictures I took, like when you, when you make like videos like youtube videos and everything you kind of like you record like this and then you just take a pose and then like you screenshot it and that's how you get your thumbnail and all of the ones that i did for the, t the tutorial that i'm about to put live were sh shocking um because like the light situation and just i'm ugly <laughs> um so i'm just um gonna send the, p those pictures to my laptop and then I'm going to um, put the video live since it's teeny bit delayed because it is quarter to seven. I usually like to put my videos live at half six. I'm actually a day late because this should have gone up yesterday. But I just, I did not expect to be doing my car for as long as I was. I'm not going to lie. Um, I've just shot some content super quickly for Pour Moi, which is where my face is all did. And Tom and I are going to have a little date night. A date night in uh, tier three means you have to stay at home. So I have my makeup done. Um, I'm going to do my hair in a sec. And then I'm going to, and I've got my dress on as well. I'm going to have a nice dress. I'll show you guys in a sec. Um, and then you wear your slippers that's what date night in tier three is this is basically apart from the lip everything is kind of what i wore in that jacqueline hill tutorial the one that's about to go live um any any momento now and the lip is just mac cork uh lip liner and mac peach dark lipstick and mac clip clear lip gloss that's the only thing i miss about working at mac is the lip stuff well not the lip stuff just those specific lip items well hello good morning how are we all um today's friday i did not vlog yesterday because i was working um but i'm off today because i've got so many errands and i've got my hospital appointment um but yes yeah, so basically i and sorry if the angle is really bad i brought a car mount for my camera five years ago when i did vlogtober and vlogmas in 2015 if you have been here that long i beg of you please leave me a comment down below like I, even if you don't usually comment like i just want to know who has been with me for that freaking long because good god um you guys have seen me grow so much um so yeah um i've brought a car mount and it just you can't angle it so that my camera's in so you're just resting at the moment and i pray to god you're okay so it is the morning. I know you're like, Sophie, you're washed, you're dressed. It's 10.27. I'm washed, I'm changed. I've done my brows, I've got false lashes on. My hair is in a messy bun. We're not surprised, I know. I am in my car, I am driving. Um, that's how you know it's gonna be a very um, productive day. So, we need to go to, oh my God, there are people on my roof. Right, I need to turn the corner and you guys are gonna go fucking flying. Let me hold on. And turn, turn, turn. We're all turning. We are all turning. Delicious, I was in the wrong lane, so. Mamacita needs to go over here. Um, oh, now my windows wanna fuck up. Assholes. Um, so we need to go to the salon because I have my Bolton clinic on Monday and I need to pack all my stuff up and prep for that. So we're going to there now and then I'm gonna run into Asda super quick and return an ASOS parcel. Um, and then I'm going to the hospital because I have my nose appointment for my review and I'm praying to God they have the results because if not, I will probably cry. Um, and hopefully they have an answer about my nose. Again, if they don't, it's not even a probably for that. If they don't, I will cry. Um, oh my God, every time I move, I have to, oh my camera. Oh, my camera's already falling to pieces. I'm only in second gear, I need to be higher. There we go. Um, so yeah, I'm doing that as well. And then I am going to get my nails done. My friend Amelia is doing my nails for me. Um, and then, 
feel like my day is more busier than that. Oh, I need to go to Trafford Centre. I'm going to Trafford Centre after the hospital appointment and before my nails. And then my nails. And then Tom and I are just going to have a nice little evening in together um, with the takeaway and everything. So, yeah. And then tomorrow is his birthday. Tomorrow we're going to go to town. Um, do a little bit of shopping, I think. And just have a nice day, I hope. Um, but, yeah. I am just going to go to the salon now and I'll see you when I get there. Oh my gosh, what a mare. I need to turn that car on because I'm not gonna lie, I'm freezing. I am at the um at the hospital now. It's like I'm seeing a doctor, but it's like, why is this? I feel like this lash is making me look like I've got a lazy eye. Why did I do this? Um it's at a hospital, but I am seeing a doctor. Um it's just like private, but it's through the NHS, like that's why I've had to wait so long. Um I did not vlog me going into the salon because while I was driving to the salon, um, so basically yesterday I was working all day and I was like, driving and everything and it was freezing and my car would not warm up. The only time it got like remotely warm was when I was doing over 50 miles an hour. And I was like, what is going on? Why is my heat not working in the middle of December? Like this is not fun. Well, the beginning of December, but you know what I mean. Um, so I was like, what the hell is happening? And then I got in and again today and it still wasn't working and I was like, no! And like, I could see my breath and everything and I was like, this is not fun. Um, and then the middle of me getting into the salon, a light popped up on my um, dashboard. I was like, what is this light? And it was like flashing. And if a light flashes, I get worried. Like if it just stays there, I'm like, man, it's fine. If it flashes, that's like selfie, look. So I pulled over, thankfully where I was, was that traffic light and like B&M was next door. So I just pulled into B&M and Googled it. My coolant um, temperature thing was low. So I was like, right, okay. so. Uh, Tesco's was like a three minute Tesco's was like a two to three minute drive away so I turned the car off googled it all blah blah knew what I needed to do turned it on and the light had gone so I was like okay it can't have been that serious went to Tesco's brought some coolant anyway opened up my trunk and where the coolant was like you opened it and like smoke was coming out and it was like sizzling there was not a drop of anything in there i was like oh shit um my car is just about to die basically it was about to overheat and die which is why there's been no heating and now i've got heating and it's nice and warm so i've topped up that and i was just really worried about timing because obviously i need to get to my appointment here at the hospitals um so i just ran into the salon i quickly topped up my botox um because i need this brow a little bit higher so at the moment this one's ever so slightly higher this one has always been my prominent brow so it, it like always sticks up a little bit more whereas this one's a bit more of like a lazy brow so i've just added some more to lift him um i would literally rush to did that packed my shirt and left ran into asda dropped off the um parcel and i picked up this because one of the people that i follow on sophie b booty she does does she do keto i'm pretty sure she does yeah she knows she does keto yeah i follow some people that do keto and some people that just are weight loss people anyway but she said that this is delicious and it's keto so for the whole of this it's only 2.7 carbs i love bounty i am i don't care if you find it weird i am that weird person i love bounty bounty is my favorite favorite chocolate I don't know if I've ever really spoke about it. I don't really like chocolate. Like, I could not eat a Dairy Milk or a Galaxy or something. I could eat, like, a Bounty, a Twix, a Snickers. Like, it has to be something else with chocolate around it for me. Because, like, you know, like a chocolate hubnub. Like, that's my thing. Like, so, I love a Bounty. So, I picked up that, um, which I'm going to try later on when I have my lunch. I brought my lunch with me so that when I go and get my nails done by Amelia, I can eat my lunch as well. Um... So yeah, pops into us to do that and then I've just come straight here. So we're going to do this appointment. I'm a little bit early and because of COVID, I don't want to go in too early. So I'm just going to wait like five minutes and then go in. So like blotchy the hair i understand but why do i look blotchy um i am home tom is just popped to sainsbury's for me because i need some stuff for the curry goat um some ingredients to like marinate it and that and i 
um i don't have them and i just went to pick up our food so i was like well i can't go because i'm carrying the food oh for some reason my beauty room oh my god my beauty room pen was in the living room um so yeah i've got my nails done very short there's no acrylic it's just gel um and i got my nails done yeah i just think i'm gonna do them short for a little while as in like two weeks and then i've got my christmas nail appointment with ashley so i need to actually look at some inspiration for the nails that i want um and then decide what is everyone doing for christmas we are we have a plan um for our christmas i won't share it with you now i will wait to make sure that it's confirmed first but yeah, what is your what is your plan? Let me know. I'm just gonna write this card. Saturday, it's Tom's birthday. He's already popped into town to um, get his hair cut, and I'm just gonna go and meet him now. Well, I'm gonna go to Primark, and then when he's finished, I'll meet him. Um, he's opened his presents and he was happy with them all, so let's go to town. So Thomas, Thomas. Um, we've just got back. I just take my makeup off so I look a bit blotchy and I don't really care. I thought I'd show you what I got from Primark. I'm not gonna do a haul because I didn't get that much stuff. I'm actually wearing two of the pieces now. So I got this little black bralette thing. It was in the sale. It's like a woolish material and it was four pounds and then I got these like lounge trousers. Um, they've got like a faux pocket um, and they're a cuff detail. They are humongous. I've had to fold them up um, so that they kind of fit. Um, but I got those. And then Tom wanted a Christmas jumper. I think he's doing something with work where they have to wear a Christmas jumper. So this is the one that we chose. Well, he was like getting his head on and I was just sending him pictures, but we chose this one. It just says sleigh bells ring all over it and then i got this little cardigan which i was thinking i'm gonna just wear as oh got something there. i'm gonna wear as a top with some like um of my flared jeans and some like little booties but it's just like a little oh um that was four pounds i think the bottoms were 13 tom's jumper was i only spent 45 quid so it wasn't that much tom's jumper was 12 this was eight. Um, so yeah, it's just like a little white. All the buttons, there's more buttons, don't worry. All the buttons are gold. And I just thought this as the top with some like flared wide leg kind of jeans would be cute. And then I got myself a Christmas cardigan because I think I'm definitely lost weight here. I know that's where I've lost it. And I was like, I don't want to wear a jumper and no one see it. Like I want to wear a cardigan. So I got this and this one was 12 pounds as well so i got this i just thought this with like a little vest um it's really cute it's got like um stockings on and a christmas pudding and a little snowman and a little christmas tree so i just got that oh what does it say on there merry christmas merry christmas beautiful we are why well, say we i am just cooking dinner now we're having curry goat um rice and peas cabbage and plantain we've got some plantain for we to the market today um, and yeah, Tom's having a really good birthday. We spent some time in Spinning Field as well, just like walking around and everything. So we've got some Christmas bits up, which I think I vlogged. I think my eye looks a bit weird. Sorry, I've just been rubbing it. Um, but yeah, let's just carry on with the evening. I'm gonna end the vlog today at some point, probably later, and I'll show you the food and everything. Um, so then I can edit it so we can go up tomorrow. So let's go.
in the league, how, how compact they are winning. Just a really quick one. This is Tom's birthday cake from Lucy's Little Bakery. Look how big that is. Christ. Check her out, honeys. Hi, everybody. It's around the 11 o'clock mark. I think it's like 20 to 11 or something. I have quite literally just woken up from a nap. Um, I think like, I was exhausted anyway. Um, but I think having like, rice and everything for the first time in basically two months. Um, Jake is toll on me, toll on me, toll on me. I don't freaking know, guys. But um, I need, Bubba, Bubba needed a little nap, a little, little, little sleep. Um, so I just woke up from my sleep. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Because it is basically Sunday. So you will see this vlog today. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I don't remember what happened. Next week will be a bit funner. Um, I've got work on Monday, but on Tuesday I'm going to Chester. And I'm working again on Wednesday. Maybe Chester will just be fun, and that's all. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next week. Sorry there has been only one video this week. I have been absolutely crazy with so much stuff going on. Um, and I'm announcing something tomorrow on my Instagram, today the day that you see this um which might make more sense as well and i'll talk about it in next week's vlog um but yeah just i've just been so crazy so much stuff so um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this i hope you stay safe love you all and i will see you next week bye